is the lift tour in London. It's a tour of lifts and escalators in London. This all of this this part is one, so this will just have the lifts. The second part will be the escalators. But now just do the lifts at the start. And there will be something in. First into the St Pancras International. That has a fudgy tech and it has a chassis and it's shaftless, yes. I've rode shaftless before. I this is the second one I think I rode, yeah. Because the first one I rode was a shaftless express lift in the fountain that were modded by Elan at that time. But it still kept its original express. But this is the second shaftless lift I ever rode rode. And that's in it's a bit slower than the lift in the fountain. But let's start with London. Let's see how good they are. London. And this is called the Tour of the Lift. Welcome to Lifts in London. And this is called the Tour of the Lifts in London. Let's see. Let's remind you, Ben I created the lift in 2009. First is the lift. The call has been accepted. Big, has been accepted. big chassis the up there. Right yes. Door. Big chassis up there. It's good. Well, welcome to the lift. And the first lift is the St Pancras one. It's a shaftless one between to the shopping centre. And it has a chassis, means it's good. If the lift doesn't have a chassis, that's not good, is it? So let's see. Yes. Look through the lift doors. Chassis. Yes. And it's shaftless. It's a brilliant shaftless lift. The rope shoot. Yes. Yes. Is that a child? No. No. <laughs> Check out the W3 one. Yes! Brilliant. It's a fidget tech. It's chassis, good. Massive proper chassis. That's what we need. Oh. Oh, is it so crazy? large. Let's go to G. Sure, the people getting on. No. Yeah, so don't close the door. I wasn't pressing, I didn't close the I didn't press the closing okay. doors. Oh. I didn't press the closing okay. doors. I'm it's like your own voice, but it's not. It's quite fast, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it's like a room. It's a fidgy tech, but it's a room. Grand flip. Bad levelling for it. Doors open. And that's it. Next one, as the in. Next one is as the in Bumbley Park with an eco disc. Yeah. See you in a bit. Now into the next ones. This is a Kone, yes, and I think it's an eco disc what stations use. Yes, and this is in St Pancras to the Metropolitan Line to Wembley Park, where I'm going to Wembley Park, and there's a Hamilton Rift and City and Circle Line too. Now, it's the eco disc station. It's been Thank you. 
Station and it will have his Look who's on the tube to Wembley Park during Wembley Park when we are going to Wembley Park at my favourite supermarket types company Asda. Because I like going to Asda, and it's my choice going to Asda. And there was a pigeon. If you're scared of pigeons, just skip to a video, to the next list. It's in the station, a pigeon. Here we go. Hello, pigeons. The pigeon. Scary. Hello, Mr. Pigeon. How did he get here? Did the bus window smash? The train window smash? Could have been like that. Oh, that was good. Oh, he's coming out again. He just came out again. Just came out. Oh my lord, I was sending this to BBC News and they'll show it. I think I'll send it to BBC News to show on the news, do you think? <laughs> now to the Wembley Park <laughs> tube station lift. Head into the lift a minute. Which is an Otis and it was mod by a generic Otis. So from an old Otis, now modded to a generic Otis. And last time it was broken. How cheap is this Otis? Let's see if they work or not. It must be working. Please tell me it works. Yes, it is. So, it was not working last time. And now it is now working. This is a platform lift and it's an Otis. Generic. Used to be an old Otis. And it was not enough by notice. This is a little Wembley Park station, tube station. And we're going, it's so slow and it used to be really old. Now it's a generic. Here we go. persons, 1250 kilos, don't know this is this too, good, I prefer when it's old, and that's it, old door track, and see you soon, and next is Asda Wembley Park. Now into Asda Wembley Park. Which has a Kona Eco disc. Let's ride it. It's a second generation with an MX10. Four to one. And if it's a small cab size, that's what it is. If it's big, if it's bigger and taller, it is a two thousand kilo because this takes a twelve to five kilo. Now to it, and it's epic. This Eco disc, and it's quite in bad condition, but still really good Eco disc, and still quite an intelligent. Only a couple of seconds away from leveling, and that's it. In that start. And the park. And now it's time for the eco disc. Two places going on. So now we're in the park. And this is from the park. And now it's time for the eco disc. Two places going on. So now it's time for the eco disc. Back up the end. That's good. It's only two for six pounds. No, that's a piece of 30. Cheaper than I thought at 30 pounds. Because I thought it should be worth more than 40. I was 35, so that's 30. Yeah. Basket. Yeah. Basket. Yeah, eco disc is still working. Yes. 
Lift! I can't wait to tell you what you Oh no, we go to my special a special list I like. And it's time. Oh how did it <laughs> Yeah Open Opened it looks like it had sensors on it. This is the lift of Asda in Wembley Park. It's Kona Eco Disc creation. Brilliant. I know. There's seafood there. Don't get on the floor, Dan, please. No. Dirty. Right. Third floor. Last three, Central Francis, Robson, Parky, Lane, Dutton, Tiffany, Dutton, Tiffany. Did you go back to G? No, Simon, I need to look at something. Can I have, can I go and then? No, 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 you can move on. And then I will have two more. Will we have go up and down again? But we'll still use the lift. And see you in a minute. I just wrote here. MX10 logic. The logic is normal electric. Yeah. This is MX10 motor. And that's it for a bit. Here we go. And I still one blue car. That was faster than it was faster than. We return now. I return back into the eco disc, and it's the same lift, and it's the eco disc, and same lift. I just now I return back to the lift here. Lift at in Wembley Park. Here's the MX10 logic. Well, actually, it's the LCE logic. Yes, this is one of the best lifts in London. The Eco Disc MX10. We're gonna go two rides down, one up, two rides down, like right, two up, two down. Yes. Yeah. Look at that, it's weird. Capacity is 225 kilos, 17 persons, built in 2007. Wow, instant door close. I like that. Security camera up there. Brilliant. It's quite fast, you can feel it quite fast, isn't it? Serial number is 10907669. This lift is powered by Kone Eco Disc. Should we do one more ride? No, no, no. Look at this door bit. And. That's Now into the Shinner 7000, or known as the Myconic. Shinner Myconic, now known as the 7000. Because this is a high-rise building, there are five sets of it. This is the first set that goes up. We're going up to ground, going up to one. Let's ride it, and it's really epic. It has a massive... Good floor numbering and it's massive. It from G, U, G, and then one. And we're going to one. And it has really intelligent leveling and it has a massive chassis. Yes, this is exactly the type of a. But sadly, it doesn't. This one uses different buttons to it. And it has doors opening. This lift, lift going up.
lift is going up, doors closing, and this one, and 5500 would not do that, so this is a 7000. <laughs> this lift at Battersea Power Station. One or two? One. Oh. Shouldn't I? Shouldn't I? This is. Shinra, yes. I like it when it goes doors closing, doors open. One, doors open. Okay. Past the 26 persons, see if I can clear on. We'll go ride it down again. And the circle lift is an Otis. Now into a, another Schindler Myconic 7000 and this goes from 1 to 12. How epic is that? It's so fast and intelligent levelling. And then lift 109 is a Battersea one. And this one will give you more intelligence how to know what Battersea power station is. And then lift 109 is the notice. Let's see them and let's look at the just let's see how good they are and listen to the education and this will show how Battersea Power Station was once formed and once Battersea Power Station was also once used as a landmark in the World War Two, so the Germans know where to bomb. But they did not bomb it because they used it as the landmark. It wasn't um the station B of the power station was not was constructed in nineteen thirty seven and then during the war it wasn't fully constructed until nineteen fifty five. To begin your journey, we are at the heart of the power station, deep inside the fiery depths of the furnaces. The power station was one of the most advanced of its time, incorporating the latest technology and engineering innovations. used to have 16 chimneys and then it went to 8 and then it went to 6 and then it went to 4 let's get to the lifts Please enter the elevators and enjoy the next step on your journey. Another way. Press the button. 
Because we have in the lift, but other people are coming in as well. Monday in a bit, darling. Can you hear me, 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 Can
That's your, uh, that's uh, Pimlico, isn't it? There's all those facts. Thank you. Thank you. We just took a picture of this. I saw the BT Tower, I kept filming the BT Tower and London Eye, I've been up the London Eye and I saw the view of the BT Tower but I've been up London Eye and I've been up Tower Bridge. <laughs> It has also has a revolving restaurant. BT Tower used to have a revolving restaurant as it was a post office tower in the 60s and it's still known as a landmark and now it's becoming now a luxury hotel as I heard on the BBC News. Now BT Tower over there, the tall building. Yeah, it was revolving restaurant. I'm catching it on camera. Is that a landmark? It's going to be stiff. Thirty seconds left. Jonathan, a big bend. Okay, we're going down. I'm going to stay on. Going down. Sparks. Look at this, the motor. Country. Motor. Oh, sorry. Oh, diving on chassis. My oh, lord. It's got two di more diagonal chassis. More diagonal chassis. More. How many does it take for a chassis? There's a lot of dark blue chassis. More. This is weird as chassis. Look at this. Ooty. And that's it for the next one. And now to the shin again. We're back on the shin of seven thousand, back down to level one for full one. This is fast. Yeah. Oh, she's 5,500. <laughs> oh, <laughs> is that a video? Is a video? Look at the reflection on the, on the river. Nice. <laughs> Let's stop there. <laughs> Do you want to go back? <laughs> yeah. That's a good shot. Yeah. Oh, I can see that. That's going to hurt it. Go on, Photoshop it. Where's the restaurant? Uh, just down here. Let's see if we can get in early. Yeah, and after that, can we... Now to the sh another Shinna 7000 is really intelligent, levelling again. 
to ground floor, all known as upper ground. Should we use the glass from down there? After we've been to the restaurant. Which one? Should we use the glass from down there? And it's so this epic. Is the epic. in the lift at Battersea Power Station, Battersea. That is fast. That's fast. It is going down. GG. Beaten. Dolphin. Alright, Shinna. Look how much it levels. Ready, steady. Wow! Proper leveling. Capacity 26 persons since I was in 12.